Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Angelina. She's gonna be my helper for today. She's simply gonna follow all of my steps for this video and I hope you guys like it. So I'm gonna start off by using the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade in the shade Caramel. Now for my face, I'm using the Fenty foundation. I'm using the whitest shade that they have. You guys can use any white paint that you guys want. I'm going to be applying this with a beauty sponge so that it looks like it's very well blended on my skin and it doesn't look like there are missing spots. Next, I'm going to be taking some translucent powder. You guys can use any brand that you guys wish to use. I just grabbed a random one that I, that I purchased. So I'm going to be taking a big fluffy brush and I'm going to be applying this all over my face. Next, I'm going to be going in with the Smashbox Full Exposure Palette and we're going to be using this black shade in the corner and we're going to be applying this on our crease. By the way, you guys, don't mind Angelina's black eye. She was having a little trouble blending her <laughs> eyeshadow, but it's okay. You're a good girl. <laughs> yes, of course, I got you. I gotta help her with her black eye because, girl, <laughs> that was going on your eyebrows. <laughs> Next, we're going to be going in with this silver shimmery shade and we're going to be applying this on our lid. Next, go ahead and take a fan brush just to take off all of that extra powder that falls onto your face because it will make a mess, especially if you're using black colors and grays. All these dark shades and cool tones, they will always mess up your foundation if you don't clean it out. Next, I'm going in with the first brush that I used and I'm not going to take any product. I'm just simply going to blend out the crease so that we can get a smoky eye. Next, I'm going to be going in with these lashes from KJ Lashes. They're in the style Boss Bitch. Sorry for the misspelling, you guys. I believe they do their own packaging. So I think they like messed it up. But yeah, they misspelled bitch on there. So <laughs> I wouldn't know how to spell that word, right? <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to link down the link below. So in the description, if you guys want to go and purchase these lashes, they're only $7. And if you use my discount code EMILY15, you guys will get a free item from KJ Lashes. So yeah, you guys. So before I apply my lashes, I'm going to be going in with my Max Volume Mascara from Wet n Wild. I'm just going to be applying two coats so that they blend in and my lashes don't look too fake. Next, I'm going to be going in with my duo glue to apply my lashes. I know I didn't show it in my video. I have no clue why. I guess I forgot. <laughs> but yeah, that's the glue that I use. And I believe it's like $5. And I honestly, I love this glue. It's the only glue that I use for my eyelashes. I used to use another one before, but it's not as good as this one. Ever since I discovered it, this is the only one that I use. Next, I'm going to be going in with this red shade from the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lipstick Palette. And I'm going to be applying this on my nose. And of course, I have to help Angelina a little bit with her nose because her lines are a little bit off, but I still think she was doing a really good job. Next, I'm going to be using the same red shade and I'm going to be applying this on my lips as if I'm doing my normal lipstick and then we'll continue with the next steps. Next, we're going to be doing a line almost as if we're doing a wing eyeliner, but on our lips. So I'm going to drag this upwards, as you guys can see. And then I'm going to be connecting that to my top lip so that it looks, so that it makes my mouth look a lot wider and bigger. And of course, I'm going to be helping out Angelina a little bit with her lines. 
Next, we're going to be dragging this line, curve it upwards, and then just draw it straight up to the center of where our eye is, just leaving it only up to the lash line. Please do not poke your eye, this will burn. <laughs> After we have marked both of our lines, we're just going to go back in there with the brush and apply a little bit of more red so that it looks a lot more dark and defined. Next, I'm going to be taking some more red lipstick and I'm going to do a small line coming out from the top of my eyebrow and we're gonna make sure that this is very very well lined up with the line under our eyes. Next we're gonna be going in with some fake blood. I got this one at Walmart. It was only one dollar and we're gonna take a little sponge and apply this on our lips. But be careful to not get this in your mouth, you guys. Trust me, it tastes bad. It happened to me. <laughs> Accidents happen. But anyways, just apply a little bit on your lips and up on those lines like I am about to do right now. Next, I waited for the blur to dry and I used this black lipstick from the Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick palette. And with a small brush, I applied some over that blur so that it looks a lot darker. Because obviously this blur, I mean, it's fake. It's going to look very, very red. So I'm applying a little bit of black just so that it looks like a little bit more realistic. And it looks a lot more better. After I applied the black lipstick, I'm going to be going back in with some blood so that it starts to look a lot more real. Next, I'm gonna be applying some of that black lipstick with the same brush, just a little bit on my nose so that it looks a little bit darker because it's really, really bright, but I'm not gonna be applying any blood. Next, we're gonna be using these wigs. Angelina's gonna be using the long one and I'm gonna be using the short one. After applying her wig, I'm gonna be putting on a small bow on her hair. Well, the wig's hair. <laughs> just so that it looks a lot more cute since she's little. And then I'm gonna be applying my wig. And of course, we had the laugh of our life because Angelina had never put on anything like this, so we were laughing at how she looked. And then it was my turn to apply my wig. That is all for this tutorial. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. And thank you for watching.